G'day. Welcome to our online fishing report. This is our fourth edition. And this week was worth being here, I can tell you. We had some great fun nearly every night. Now, there was good hatches nearly every night, so that's what makes it that's what makes the fun, of course. Um, each night we're out, we're getting anything between five and say ten fish. You lose count after a while in the in the fun of it. Uh, lots of mixed sizes and the caddis hatch pretty much in the early part of the rise was terrific and got the fish up so if you were lucky enough to be here and there was a few of us around fishing each of the nights um, it was a pretty damn good week so bring on some more of that I reckon. The hatches through the week were a really interesting ray of the caddis hatch going on and it was the pupa, the emerging pupa and the adult caddis and everybody was fishing pretty much a different fly and catching fish so it was kind of special when that happens um, that everything was working so we had good nights every night we were out. As for the duns they were big and you know when I say big they were about a size 12 light coloured body very dark wing and a few would get a couple of fish up but as soon as you got 20 coming down above a line all the fish switched over from caddis straight onto the duns. So if you had good eye, if you've got good eyesight and you can change quick, then you can pick up the extra fish on the dun hatch. Now a couple of the evenings the dun hatch was actually earlier, so no problems those nights. But it's very hard to pick which night it's going to be, but you have to be out there going for it. So about the middle of the week uh, we had a bit of a weather change and we got some rain. And it was pretty heavy during the night and a little bit through the day, but it managed to colour the river up a bit. The pondage is still clear, so it looks like this will take a few days to drift through the river and each day it settles and clears more. So it hasn't affected the hatches as far as we can tell when the river first changes colour. It's not that discoloured. So we're still expecting reasonable hatches tonight and over, over the weekend because the water temperature hasn't changed at all. It's still a low flow like it was at the early part of last week. The, weather's for the, the weather forecast for the weekend is cool and mild, so low 20s. We're expecting pretty good hatches off that, so get up here if you can.